guys welcome to another monday motivation video it's so glad to have you god bless you thank you for coming thank you for clicking the link thank you for hearing thank you in advance for sharing for commenting and for liking the video because we know that you can support the community and invite your friends to join us too now we're going straight into the video so in the light of the thanksgiving season that we are now in the thanksgiving that occurs in november so what's the like for us people november happens in the u.s i'll be having we're having the monday motivation from inspiration instead of monday perspective on the blog so um this is another piece by our very awesome miss miriam and it is titled it is the season of love and thanksgiving so i'm just going to go ahead and read the article it is the season of love and thanksgiving by miss miriam almost every one of us has tasted life at the bottom before god graciously lifted us up Looking back, it is impossible to forget where God took me from. But true gratitude is not only in remembering the horror from which God delivered us. Much more than that, it is wholeheartedly committing to helping others out of that horror. There is no prayer joy and to know that God gave us the needed gifts much earlier in life so we could grow to a point where we could come back to help him lift others who are now where we used to be this is the true essence of life and humanity and to walk away from this is to cease to be human and to wallow in abject depravity now it is a season of love and thanksgiving and the heart that must be grateful to God was of necessity first commit to putting a smile on the face of another. God wants you to be to others what he has been to you. He wants you to identify a soul that you could help at least one wrong of the ladder of life. Good morning. Have a splendid week ahead. So I believe that um, I and Miss Miriam has been sincerely led of God's spirit to write certain things on the floor because as much as Thanksgiving is being grateful, having a, a thankful heart and just being so in touch with how much God has done for you and counting your blessings and everything. Much more importantly, because you have seen how much growth and development in your life, like you should wish that for other people. You should wish that as much as I have grown and I've seen the light and I, I have done so much and I have been in a better place than I used to be before. I want to see other people be better. That should be the mindset at this point. Being grateful, saying, oh God, I thank you. That is awesome. That is good. That's probably even the best. But even better is wanting someone else to be better and feel the same way you feel. So you, you receive Christ. You receive that life. That is the light of life. You receive eternal life. You receive a better way of living. You know how it feels to have Christ. You know that the wonders of being a child of God. You know how much you've grown and just lived a whole better life. Like, well, like you should want to see that for another person. Even if like, you might not be a Christian, you might not believe the gospel, maybe you're still struggling with certain things. But being grateful isn't just being, it's not just by your spirituality or your religion. Being grateful is just human. Like, you could be grateful and want another person to be happy so they can be grateful to and like be better than they were before but that's how the 
cleansing circle cycle will begin and continue with God's grace. The cleansing circle of the depraved world we live in. The sort of wicked world. So if one person decides to be grateful and help someone else be grateful and help someone else, and everyone, I think, with so time, like the butterfly effects, with so time, everyone will be cut off doing the heart of gratitude and helping others. So thank you for watching this video. Thank you for being patient enough to join our community and comment and, comment and like and share. Really appreciate. So, catch us next week. And be anticipate, anticipate sweet content. Again. Okay.